the trouble ticket three same scenarios no change let's look at the question same exact question web server uh, 209 65 200 241 client one and cannot access that it's the same answers but scenario situations is very different so now uh, back to scenario uh, sorry layer two topology or you can click you know uh, layer three topology no harm so again i'm going to pick a middle point here let me ping uh, uh, my web server yeah i can ping good to go so it's a problem is going to be downstream so can i ping my client uh, two three of course i can't so the issue is downstream so let me go to r4 r4 boom enable ping 209.65.200.241 can upstream work so no problem from r4 seem to looks like a downstream problem so let me ping whether i can ping at least to my nearest interface which is 16.1.14 uh, how am i doing here 14 okay 14 is good to go how about uh, 2.1 my gateway address i can't so from r4 you can ping the access switch so there's no local issue uh, so I believe you know you can do again the show interface brief um, your interface is 2.1 is an up and up pass it in at 114 is an up and up so seem to be looks good uh, so what could be the problem here um, let me ping from here the local interface is 16 2.1 I can't ping 2.1 but the interface is up and up let me re verify again yes 2.1 is up and up but i can't able to i'm not able to ping i'm not able to ping that interface why okay where is my interface uh, 2.1 vlan 10 the vlan vlan 10 is being defined but i'm not able to ping the guy well my show vlans show vlans vlan 10 client vlan active there is no ports there of course there's you know in the distribution there's nobody using it is in the access switches uh, i think it should be you know since the issue is more layer two you know what i'm going to do i'm going to go to the uh, layer two topology and uh, focus on the issue on the uh, uh, and here let me do access switches here uh show vlan okay there are two ports which is connected to vlan 10 and uh port uh show there is a command call uh, let me think of uh what is the command that i used um, interface Oh, that is show trunk. Show trunk. Let me do a show. Yeah, you and K, right? Show trunk. I should be able to do the show trunk. Show interface. Um, uh, let me do. Let's see, am I stuck here? Okay, show interface is up. Yeah, good to go. Uh, show VLAN. What else? Show interface. I'm sorry, uh, it is a show interface uh, trunk. Okay, show interface trunk at ASW looks good. VLAN allowed at port 109 and uh, 19 is 1019. Okay, let me go into uh, uh, show interface switch. Uh, is there another command called switch port here? No. I think I need to go to the access distribution switch here and let me see here. Uh, show interface trunk. So you got to know your commands and the implications here. Hmm, did you notice something here? ASW comparisons. So you have a trunk interface at FRC 0119, 0119, uh, only VLAN in a 19 allowed to go through on the DSW uh, 1. Uh, so the 98, sorry, 98 only. Uh, there's a parking lot VLAN, not, you know, the clients are in a VLAN 10, 
so VLAN 10 it is not allowed to pass through DSW1 hmm so that seemed to be the issue there so that's already where there's an issue uh, there's not is there any other way to verify these or do for any other further validations um, uh, what uh, show MAC address see some commands aren't recognized but now there should be a show MAC address table uh, how about here show MAC address table so the other commands are not kind of enabled but roughly we know where the answers let me go into the uh, troubleshooting now uh, and, and see where is the, my ticket here right so the, uh, the the problem is in the DSW1 I mean sorry DSW1 not in SW1 okay next question is related to uh, is switch to switch connectivity yes next question what is how do we resolve yes under the F1019 and the switch port trunk allowed VLAN 10 and 19 because the 10 VLAN 10 is missing there okay so done got it correct